this is the A part. We'll start off with the clearance lights. My five clearance lights are not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no missing bulbs, not missing any nut bolts. There's no water inside. They're all properly mounted and they are amber in color. My tractor hood is not cracked, broken, or damaged. It's properly mounted and always straight. My headlights are not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no nut bolts missing, no bulbs missing, no water inside. They're all properly mounted. And my high beam and low beam are clear in color or white in color. And then my four-way flasher and turn signals are amber in color. Then my tractor bumper is not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted and always straight. My license plate is not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no nut bolts missing. No numbers or letters missing. It's properly mounted and up to date with the DMV. And underneath the tractor, there's no signs of leakage, no diesel fluid. No coolant, no transmission fluid, no water on the ground. And all of my hoses and wires are hanging properly, not touching the ground. And my truck is not leaning to one side. Leaning indicates either broken suspension, flat tire, or misloaded trailer. Then my hood latches are not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no nut bolts missing, and they're easy to open and easy to close. My hood latch is not cracked, damaged, or broken, and it's properly mounted. And you open the hood by placing your foot here. Then my air compressor, you follow the air compressor hose. So my air compressor is not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted. There's no leaks. And my air compressor is gear driven. Then my air compressor hose, there's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks. And both sides are properly mounted. Then my engine oil dipstick is not cracked, not damaged, not broken, not leaking. It's securely tight and my engine oil level is always between minimum and maximum. And my engine oil cap is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no seal missing. It's not leaking and securely tight. And if I need to add more engine oil, I can add it from here. Then my water pump is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. There's no leaks, it's properly mounted. And my water pump is belt driven. Then my water pump hose, there's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks, and both sides are properly mounted. Then my steering column or steering shaft is not cracked, damaged or broken. There's no illegal wells. It's properly mounted and always straight. Then my U-joints are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing, no safety pins missing. And my U-joints are always clean and always greasy and properly mounted. <clears throat> then my power steering fluid tank is not cracked, damaged or broken. There's no nut bolts missing and it's properly mounted and not leaking and my power steering fluid level is always between minimum and maximum. Then my two power steering fluid caps are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no seal missing, they're not leaking, and they're always on tight. Then my power steering fluid tank hose is not cut, ripped, and there's no bubbles, and it's not leaking, and both sides are properly mounted.
that my power steering gearbox is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted and there's no leaks. Then my power steering gearbox hose, there's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks, and both sides are properly mounted. Then my hitman arm, my drag link, my upper arm, my lower arm, and my tie rod. All five are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. No castle nuts missing, no cotter pins missing. And all five are properly mounted and all joints are greasy. Then we come for our suspension system. My spring mount and spring hanger are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing and it's properly mounted to the frame. Then my spring leaps are not cracked, not damaged, not broken, not shifted, and properly mounted. Then my U-clamps and U-bolts are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. They're properly mounted. And then my spacer is not cracked, not damaged, not broken, and always present, properly mounted. Then my shock absorber is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing, there's no leaks, and it's properly mounted to the frame. Then my brake system, my brake hose and brake line, it's not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks, and both sides are properly mounted on the brake hose and brake line. Then my brake chamber is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no clamp missing, there's no nut bolts missing, clamp is always on tight, and my brake chamber is properly mounted. Then my push rod and slack adjuster are not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no hardware missing, hardware includes the pins and the bolts right here. And my push rod is properly mounted, push rod and slack adjuster are properly mounted. And my push rod play is not more than one inch. I can check by releasing my brakes on the inside and pulling by hand. It should not be more than one inch. Then my brake drum is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. It's not oily, not greasy. It's free of any debris. Properly mounted. Then my brake shoe or brake pad or brake lining is not cracked, not damaged, not broken, not oily, not greasy, always clean, properly mounted, and my brake shoe thickness is not less than one quarter inch. And also my tractor frame is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. It's always straight and properly mounted, no illegal welds. Then we come to our tire. I have there's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks in my tire tread. I have even tread wear. The grooves are always clean. And then my tire depth or tread depth is not less than 432 inches. Then my sidewalls on both sides. There's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks, no tread separation. And my tire is properly seated on the rim. Then my air valve stem is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no cap missing. The valve stem is not touching the tire and it's not leaking. And I can check my tire air pressure with an air gauge. And my tire air pressure should be 100 PSI or up to manufacturer specifications. Now the rim, my rim is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no illegal holes and no illegal welds, and my rim is properly mounted with 10 lug nuts. My 10 lug nuts are not cracked, not damaged, not broken, and there's no signs of rust and no signs of shiny metal. Rust and shiny metal indicates one of the lug nuts is loose. Then my hub oil seal 
is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. There's no leaks and it's all properly mounted. And my oil level for the hub oil seal is always full. I can check by the sight glass. Now we go to the other side. So this is my wind sealed washer fluid tank. It's not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted. There's no leaks. With my windshield washer fluid tank hose. There's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks. And both sides are properly mounted. Then my windshield washer fluid tank cap is not cracked, damaged, or broken. There's no seal missing. There's no leaks. It's always on tight. And my windshield washer fluid level is always full. My coolant tank is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted. There's no leaks in my coolant tank. And my coolant level is always between low and full. My coolant tank cap is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no rubber seal missing. My cap is always on tight and it's not leaking. Then my coolant tank hoses. There's no cuts, no bubbles, no leaks. And both sides are properly mounted. Then my alternator is not cracked, not damaged, not broken. There's no nut bolts missing. It's properly mounted and my alternator is belt driven. Then my alternator wire. There's no cuts, no burn, no pinch and no tape and both sides are properly mounted and then my belt it's not cut there's no not frayed not cracked not dry and my belt play is not more than three quarter inches and i can check that by pushing in the middle by hand and then all of my engine hoses and wires are not cracked, damaged or broken, not leaking. They're properly mounted on both sides and they're not touching any engine parts. And this is the A part is complete.